this is just about the data link layer. Uh, let us see the what is the responsibilities or what is the functionalities of network layer. So this network layer we can call with another name that is the internet layer. So both of them is same. In some uh, network technologies we can call it as a network layer. Then in some network technologies we can call it as a internet layer. So main functionality of the network layer or uh, internet layer is to <coughs> deliver IP packets where they are supposed to go. So whatever you mention the destination or IP address definitely it will exist somewhere in this uh, world. So the to deliver your packet from the source from your host to that server or that host the, this network layer is going to play a key role to deliver your packet or to identify exact host in this world this is the actual main functionality of the network layer so now <coughs> it means these packets have to be routed these packets have to be properly directed towards the destination. So that functionality will be done by this network layer. So in this main functionality, our main responsibility is main responsibilities in that first one is logical addressing system. logical addressing system this is before and we already discussed this one so this will help you to identify each system uniquely in the entire universe so with that you can able to identify any system in this world so that this functionality this logical addressing system maintenance will be done by this network layer and uh, what is the IP4 we already discussed so exactly it will be applied to here so then <coughs> next one is routing so in this routing this is also one of the functionality routing we can say that whenever you write the destination address so you your system will send that uh, packet to the locally existed router router as we discussed in the post office example whenever you post a letter if you want to post a letter you will post that let letter in your local post office that is actual thing so same here your host will first it will deliver we will it will sent to the local router from that router onwards to the destination router in between many routers have will exist so your packet have to go through this all these routers so whenever this packet will reach that uh, any router in between source to destination every router have to decide the path means because every router have the many directions to forward like every post office have the many directions to send the send all these letters so same case here also so that among all these existed ports at a particular router it have to be select the exact path or right direction towards the destination so that functionality will be done in this network layer also so you have many uh, here uh, we have many network routing algorithms are there we will discuss all this uh, and some among them some of them is distance vector routing link state routing broadcast routing and multicast routing any cast routing like this we have many routing algorithms are there we will discuss in the routing algorithms chapter this everything very clearly so this is actually the these two 